Let's talk a little bit about the five senses of student success. It's a very general framework, but I think it's fundamental to understanding uh, how we might support students in growing and developing their identities as students and also maturing towards a professional identity as well. Let's map the space of the elements of identity development in many ways. Uh, because I think in, 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 in that below the waterline sense, who am I becoming and who am I allowed to become is fundamental to a, to a successful and empowered educational experience. So there are a number of elements that we can work with independently but also collectively. Firstly, I think, is a sense of capability. Um, secondly, a sense of connectedness, that's students connecting with each other. Um, and then there's a sense of purpose. Why am I here? What am I trying to achieve? And finally, a sense of resourcefulness. How do I navigate the system and how do I make my life successful given all the, comp all the complexities I've got to navigate? So let's drop down into what a sense of capability might mean. I think fundamentally, if we help students understand what is expected of them, and help them master the basic academic skills that they're required, both in terms of the content and the process, and help them have a sense of efficacy in committing to a learning community, then very much we're helping students develop a sense of capability. But practically speaking, um, it's really about setting up learning environments where we clarify and negotiate what we expect of each other and provide them with a scaffold sense of skills that, that um, help them move forward. So, sense of connectedness. This is the relational side of success. Uh, how do we know if someone's feeling connected? Well, it's really uh, the quality of students' relationships with their peers, their staff, uh, and, 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 and generally feeling a sense of belonging and, or identification with the school or the place within which they're studying. It's that whole sense of, I belong here. And that's very much about fundamental working relationships. And, and working relationships are fundamental to success in life, generally. So let's organise our classes to help support that. Purpose? Well, you couldn't find anything more, more important in this, in this model than helping students develop a sense of why they're there, a sense of purpose for what they're doing, a sense of direction, a sense of what this might mean. Um, this is fundamental to the motivational space. How can we help this as educators? Well, it's, it's really much as about helping them make clear and informed choices about being at university, uh, helping them see the relevance of what they're doing, linking it to the, quote, real world, um, and helping them get a sense of how all this develops them, their personal strengths and talents. It's that personal and course alignment. So we talk a lot about um, students managing the transitions through a university, and resourcefulness is a key construct in all this. It's, it's really about the skills and the attitudes that help people navigate the systems that they're part of. Um, and this is very much a process of not just navigating the rules of the university, but managing their whole life, if you like. How do they balance work, life, and study commitments to be able to be, in order to be successful? Um, this is very much a meta skill of self-regulation or self-management. Once again, we can help students develop these skills by providing clear role statements about who, can, who they can go to for help and get, where they can get help from. We can help the procedures and the resources of the units become clear and transparent to students. Very important. Um, and finally, um, encourage them to seek help when they need it and provide systems that won't judge them for seeking help. And all of this, capability, connectedness, purpose and uh, resourcefulness, um, provides students with a sense of the culture within which they're working and helping them, helping them understand how things are done, what's important and valued here, and what their role is in the place. And this then helps them develop, if you like, the various senses of success. And the more we're able to be clear about what we stand for as a university and as an educator, and the more we are clear with students about um, you know, what we have to offer and what a university actually stands for, they can actually engage with that. Let's not leave this stuff implicit. Let's make this as explicit as possible. Let's do, if, let's do a process, if you like, of negotiated engagement where we understand each other.
What's the key takeaway here? Um, there are some very simple things we can do to support students to be successful at university, and they are connection, purpose, capability, and resourcefulness. All of these build identity.